At one time, a heart defect or blockage was a fatal diagnosis for a patient, but that's before a team from Harper Hospital, General Motors, and present-day Wayne State University achieved a medical breakthrough in 1952 with the world's first successful heart bypass machine. Resembling a Cadillac's V12 engine, the Michigan Heart withdrew blood from the left side of the heart, sending it out to a pump via six glass cylinders with finger-sized rubber pistons. Other cylinders circulated the blood back to the aorta, creating a dry field to operate on the heart's damaged area. On July 3, 1952, Wyandotte resident Henry Updike was the first person to benefit from the new technology. The procedure took 50 minutes, and when it was officially announced in October, the team, headed by Dr. F.D. Dodrell, made world headlines. Mr. Opdyke lived another 29 years due to extraordinary collaboration of great medical minds and the inventiveness of an automotive giant. The original Michigan heart is on permanent display in the Smithsonian Institution, where it was installed in 1954.